Look at this, look at this. Here we are. If you, I hope it's in focus. I'm on Amazon, right? And I'm looking at some boxed uh, different 3DO games and stuff. Just kind of looking. Uh, because I'm trying to, you know, still collect some of my boxed 3DO stuff. Look at this. Uh, Shockwave 2, Beyond the Gate, is the name of this one. Uh, 3DO. Look at it. Look at this. Two new games. Look how much the guy at the top wants for a sealed box copy of Shockwave 2. Which I cannot assume is worth the shipping. $2,000. How do you get the balls to want to charge $2,000 for a, a 3DO game that came out like 15 to 20 years ago on a system that barely, you know, got out of the gate before it was uh, discontinued. Look, then the second person that's selling, brand new, selling the same game, $32.22 plus $5.49 shipping. I practically bought this one just because I had such a sticker shock from that one. And then look at this guy, he at least puts down here, this item is brand new and factory sealed. This person doesn't even put that on theirs. And they have a 94% positive rating. And the other guy's got 100%. $2,000. You're fucking kidding me. That's crazy, folks. Pardon my language. I just, I can't believe that. That is way ridiculous. How can you get off? How can you even justify that price you can't that's ridiculous you're trying to fleece a collector for two thousand dollars for a game that another guy is selling for thirty two twenty five that just irks me man and it's obvious that the book grove they're not even like a video game store they're a damn bookstore they're going to put $2,000 on it. Even if it was a typo and it was $200, that's ridiculous too. I don't believe it. Oh, well, folks, I'm signing off. I just couldn't believe that. I had to throw that out there for y'all.